Hello everybody, so you're playing with a Snokia coming to you with another how-to video. Today I'm showing you how to draw a perfect comic cover out of my comic series that I will be starting. So without further ado, let's get to it. This is going to need a paper so you can scribble on. This is get a pen working. I'll show you why that in a minute. Sheets of paper. And at least two, I have three, number two pencils. And going to need a, a good eraser. Mine is used, but you can get a new one. A dollar store for like a couple bucks. Like, like 50 cents, I guess. 50 couple cents. <sighs> so I'm not feeling my best today. Anyway, let's get started. So I'm going to use the one that's most sharpened. So... Number one is creating the cover. Now, creating the cover is a very, very easy process. It's not as hard as the actual drawings themselves. But let's get to it. So let me just move my tripod so you can see just the paper. Okay, there we go. So let's get started. First, I'm going to start with a good font. Let's move the paper down. And think of what you want to call your comic. If you're writing a Minecraft comic, which I'm going to be showing an example of. Actually, now let's do a Mar like a Marvel comic, like a Star Wars comic. So if we wanted to do um, okay, so let's do the last. Let's do the Force sensitive. Actually, it's too complicated. I want to do an easy one, so let's do. Luke's return. So, so if you don't like Star Wars, but it's what I do on my channel, so start with a nice simple font. There, that's an L. Can you see that? I, bet, I think you can. Let's do. You can do your own font. That kind of looks like an N. Use are very hard to do in this font, so I think it's this. Luke. Okay, so it's K's are not too hard. Luke. Add E. Luke. It doesn't look like an S. So if you like doing. There. And this is why you have this eraser, so you can. Erase all your mistakes. And of course, if you have this on your pencil, you can still you can still use that. Luke's. Now let's do a turn. So okay, let's do. Kind of looks like an A. We got the top right. I think this needs to be more. Hmm. Ours are kind of hard to do. Hmm. Uh, Let's just do that for now. And then, yeah, this is taking a while only because this is a because this is a start. I'm doing a start thing. Now this is another U to erase that. So now let's do an R. Let's return. Ends are hard to do. Looks for turn. Now, in case this is a part two and part one comic, you can just put the abbreviation on there. P one. So let's try and do a one. Oh, the eraser broke off. That's okay. Okay, P1. Player 1 or Part 1, whichever you prefer, but I do Part 1 because that makes more sense. Now, we can ink it, as some people like to call it. Now, inking is a easy process. All you need is a pen. And this is what the thing on the left is for. Make sure your pen works. So, I'll just turn the tripod so you can see. On. 
Okay. Sorry, I would... Let's just do there. So this is what this is for. So you can ink your pen ready. There we go. Pen's ready. Now let's get ready to do the... Let's get ready to do the comic. Now, inking is very easy. All you have to do is trace your words in ink, as we call it. You can make them a little different, because you're going to be erasing the pencil anyway. The pencil is just to guide you and make sure you don't make mistakes while drawing it. That way you can erase them. But the pen, you can make mistakes, which is why we do so scratchy like this. So everything looks like a mistake. So everything's not a mistake, if that makes sense. So eventually it'll look cool. We just It's a little messy now, but I can surely fix that up. I can show you fix that up after we erase the pencil. So let's just show you now. Okay, we are back with the full ink thing here. Now we are ready to go and erase the pencil. Grab your eraser. I have a pink one, but you can use any color. Oh wait, there's something that's not. Just notice that. There we go. Okay. Let's do this one first. How's that looking? Not too bad. Erase a bit more. And there we go. Let's do a turn. Okay, so we are back. Oops. Okay. So we are back with the full cover. Now you can add some drawings on there. We will get more in the drawing in another episode, but I can just show you how to draw a good cover. So let's turn, tilt this down a bit. So we see the bottom of the page. I'll teach you about drawing a bit. Now, what do you want to draw on here? Hmm? Should we do a picture of... I'm not going to spoil anything, but let's draw a picture of Luke in his Jedi form. So, okay, so you just want to draw the basic outline of the head. There, then. This is the circle technique. I'll get into this and why we, I'll get into the, why we do this in another episode. There. Yeah, let's draw the lightsaber. There. Okay. Now we... Oh, I couldn't see that, can't, couldn't you? No. There we go, so... Okay, so that's basically the drawing done. Let's just raise that up. Now, you don't want to ink it just yet. If you already did, well... You may have to start over, but just draw like an, a basic body shape. Ba draw like a basic Jedi rope here. Or draw your, your vision of your character, whatever. But I'm just going to go over how we do. Okay, so. Let's just draw Luke here. The head's one of the most important things to draw. Now let's get into the eyes, but I'm, not, I'm, I'm gonna go over them in a different episode. Now let's redo the head. Now the hair is looking a bit stupid, so we'll just... There. And we'll get into, like, doing all the complicated stuff in the next one. There, now let's go flesh him out a bit, as I like to call it. So, let's go... There. So, this is a bit of an easy technique to follow. Just follow what I'm doing here. There. Now, this is where we ink it. So, I'll be back in a second. Okay, so now we have the 
complete cover. Now what you usually do in that cover like this is you draw like a couple more characters on the side and stuff. But overall, what I basically did for the figure is I erased all the pencil and inked it. I inked it first, just so you know. Anyway, that's basically the cover and what you need to know for the cover. Let's think of any other things. Hmm. Oh, yeah. So, when you do the cover, this is the most important part. So, you want to make it look awesome. And you want to make it look astounding. The first part... I was doing a comic book is you want to make the cover like make it pop out to people like that's why I do it in such an amazing font and like do all sorts of drawings and the stuff so basically you, you can add like a bit of lightning on there stuff like that you know fire in case it's like an action comic so just add a bit more go that's basically your cover complete. So, that is all for covering. There will be more episodes on how to draw. How to draw here and how to, and how to, like, I don't know, like, how to make, frame your comics out one by one. So, actually, we'll go over how to frame your comics out in this episode. Just seeing that we have time. Okay, so, let's go and flip it over. I'm going to use the same pencil. Why not? Anyway, the way I frame my comics out, I just do like that. Usually, when you want to do it, you usually start with the first line first, and then you do the drawing, then then do the second drawing, then do a line, then the third drawing. So, in case you want to go ahead and copy this, in case you like this idea. Go ahead and pause the video here. I'll give you a few seconds to do so. Okay, so did you pause the video? I hope you did because now I'm going to continue talking. Now, I hear, I hear some people have some habits in drawing on their eraser. The point is, I'm not going to, I don't like, I don't draw on my eraser mostly because it'll ruin the eraser. You don't have to get a new one. But there will be a link in the description to where you can get good erasers, pencils, and pens. So, overall, that is it. Do I have anything else I want to show you? Oh, yeah, I'm going to tell you I will be doing a crazy cart review later this today, I think. So, in case you want to check that out, that will be, that will be uploaded soon. So, thanks for watching. This is Supreme Leader Snoke. Signing out. Goodbye! Pizza and fries. Bye, everyone. <laughs>